Well, after dinner tomorrow, most people will be sleeping their meal off and maybe yeah. preparing for the chaos of Black Friday shopping. But there's also a chance to shop intimately with Small Business Saturday. I love this. And there are so many small and local businesses that make up our area. And the North Carolina Retail Merchants Association is highlighting this through their Shop NC initiative. I love shopping local. Yeah. We've got the vibe going on right here. <laughs> well, joining us now is the owner of one of those businesses that's been highlighted by the initiative. We're talking to Annette Conrad. She is the current owner of the candy factory there in Lexington. Good morning, Annette. Good morning. How are you today? Happy Thanksgiving. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving to you too as well. We are doing wonderful. Well, we have to ask you first. The candy factoring just sounds like so many indulgences mm -hmm. that I'm excited to drive into. So <laughs> could you first just give a little bit of background information on how the candy factory got its start? I will be happy to. The candy factory started in 1978. It was founded by the folks, the Evelyn family, who owned Piedmont Candy Company that makes Redbird Puffs. Those are still made locally here in Lexington. And they moved their small retail business up to 15 North Main Street in 1978 because they outgrew the space. And so the candy factory has been located here on Main Street, providing um, great candy and wonderful experiences to the residents of Davidson County, North Carolina, and visitors from all across the, the country. That's beautiful. And I love that you have those photos to share with us too. <laughs> that is so cool to really see history in action there. Can you we, tell we do have lots of we do have lots of history in this building. It was built in 1890. So on um, the floor is still creek. The, <laughs> the sights and the sounds and the smells are still there. So it's an it's an interesting place to to come. Very cool. OK, can you explain to us the benefit to you guys of us shopping locally and how important that is to you? But also, of course, there's a big benefit to consumers as well. Mm -hmm. Can you explain both of those? There are there. Well, of course, we are we are considered a small business and we made it through the last few years, which which has been a struggle for many small businesses. But we believe that um, shopping local is a reinvestment in the community and that it's important to strengthen our, our very livelihood in North Carolina and keep the economy thriving. And and. The North Carolina Retail Merchants Association Shop NC initiative really helps folks understand that, you know, small businesses do provide those meaningful connections in their communities. I mean, we're one of the first places people ask for a donation of a basket for a fundraiser or they're doing something for their church. And the initiative of Shop NC just um, makes that so much better for, for all merchants in North Carolina. We um, we believe when you shop local, um, we think we have really great customer service. We try to pay attention to all of our customers. We welcome you when you become you come in our store, your your family, your friends, and we want you to just have a wonderful experience and come back again. Absolutely, and that and one of the things that found that we found out recently about you guys is that you were ranked number one candy store in North Carolina by the Food Network magazine. That is an amazing feat. So, what would it feel like when you found out the big news? Well, actually, that was that was an honor that was bestowed upon the candy factory several years ago, and we we are um, very appreciative of that acknowledgement. We tend to get recognized for that 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 accolade um, continuously, even though it's been a few years. It's a real honor. Um, the Candy Factory is just a wonderful place to bring your family, wow. to create memories. Um, it's, it's great to hear people walk through the front doors and the first thing is, oh, they smell the popcorn or the combination <laughs> of the popcorn and the chocolate smell. And it's, um, or I haven't seen this since I was a child. Aww. Remember, Grandma had that in her candy dish on the coffee table. So we like to think that the these these sights and these smells just invoke those nostalgic memories and again, offer you that opportunity to create new ones with 
other members of your family. Absolutely, Annette. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. And of course, if you or someone you know has a sweet tooth, you guys can go ahead and check out the Candy Factory. They are located in Lexington on North Main Street. You can also find out more information by visiting that website there on your screen, LexingtonCandyFactory.com.